Hello everyone over here and welcome back to another FIFA 20 video and today I got Parma for you, I mean my favorite team, a huge fan of Parma, follow every game that they play in real life. I'm wearing the shirt too which a good friend of mine bought it uh, many years ago from me, uh, it's uh, an old school shirt and uh, one of the most glorious Italian teams, they done so great for Italy in Europe and one of the few teams to have a dream team. So coming back to FIFA now, uh, Parma is not the uh, best team to use but uh, they uh, have some good players there. like for example Gervinho. Now EA, we need to talk about the 90 pace on this guy, na 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 na, at least 95. You have to upgrade him, he's so quick and fast, nobody can catch him in a one-on-one -on -one situation, everybody has seen that. And going to Cornelius too, I mean apparently you haven't seen him shooting too. 73 shooting and that pace is so poor, at least 70 pace and at least 85 shooting. When he shoots, damn on them, the, the ball just doesn't take any direction except the, the direction that, that he shot it, I mean, come on. You have to enter to, to this guy, Kulusevski, one of the most talented players in the whole world right now. 71 pace on him and shooting. Have you seen him shoot? Have you seen him run? Have you seen the guy triple? Three star skill moves, come on. I mean, you can make the three star weak foot because he is the left footer and the left footer just don't use too much the right foot. But come on, making those stats of him, you just need you just need to upgrade my team because they deserve a way more that you have done them that you have done them in FIFA. Um, and to my captain, 37 pace, unacceptable. Uh, I know that uh, he is almost at the end of his career, but doing 37 pace on him. No, 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 unacceptable. And to Jan more, just upgrade him more, make more pace on him. We always seen him play, and he is just uh, lightning fast, uh, just uh, too good to make just the 79 pace of, on him. Anyway, we got to use the team that we have, and I think that what fits perfectly for this Parma is the 4-3-3, the attacking variation. Which, by the way, I think that they should use it even when they play in real life because it's gonna fit perfectly. Now, Sepe in gold, and um, our center backs are going to be Gagliolo and Jacopone. I'm sorry for my captain, I have to send him out. You see, he just did him dirty with that at 37 pace. He is not usable uh, in FIFA. So, Gagliolo and Jacopone, too good in game big and strong and fast, I really like him. Darmian, such a classy player, 5 star weak foot, you need to upgrade his pace more too, but uh, he is okay, he's gonna do great for you in game. To that left back position, he's gonna play uh, my favorite left back in Parma, uh, he doesn't play too much in that position, but I love him in FIFA. Antonino Barilla, he's got the pace, he's a great, great, great all arounder and he can play in that uh, position perfectly. Moving up to the midfield, Hernani and Kushka, I mean, 2-2-2, two, 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 uh, great all-around midfielders, the best midfielders that Parma has, in my opinion, uh, going to experience and to being all great all-arounders, absolutely love them. You got great choices there too. I, I, I wish I can play my uh, the whole players that Parma has, but we have to choose just 11. And Kulusevski is going to be your cam. He is big and uh, and strong and uh, he, is, he has good movements in game but uh, they just need to upgrade him, they need to upgrade him because he is much better than just a 70 uh, rated player. Gervinho to the, our left winger, what can you say about Gervi? Big boy Cornelius is gonna be our striker. I use Bobby after, uh, even in the second half directly or even after minute 60, uh, 65, just use uh, a Bobby in laser so you can give him minutes too. Moving to, to the right wing is going to be Jan Karamoa there, I mean, he's so talented, just upgrade him more, man, I mean, he's, he's amazing when you watch him play in real life, anyway, uh, you got uh, great subs here, you got uh, Inglese and uh, you got Grassi for one of the midfields, and don't forget about this player here, Silly Garti, I love him, one of the most talented left footers I've ever seen play, man, I mean, uh, he's so great, very intelligent, absolutely love, love, love him, love him uh, when he plays. 
and uh, just uh, if you don't like Kulusevski in that camp position, make sure that you use a uh, uh, silly guard. And moving up to the tactics, very very important. We're gonna keep everything in balance, and uh, I tried with four, but now we're gonna keep with with five and uh, deep four and uh, with five and players in the box four, and everything is going to be balanced. Corners and free kicks, I'm gonna leave at two, and it's gonna work just perfectly uh, for uh, Parma. Uh, moving up to the to the roles, uh, captain no doubt is going to be Jacopone after Bruno Alves. He is our captain. Uh, so uh, sorry, uh, I I have to show you the custom instructions, uh, which I'm going to show you in a second now. Moving on to the custom instruction, uh, getting behind and cut inside uh, for Jervy. I mean, uh, he's going to make him run uh, down that wing. Cut inside and get in behind for Karamoa, get in behind, stay forward for Cornelius and stay forward for Kulusevski. With those four, you're just gonna do damage in the counter attack. Stay back while attacking cover center for both Hernani and uh, Yurai Kushka. And uh, don't worry, they will join the attack too and stay back while attacking uh, for both of the fullbacks. I mean, uh, this is the starting 11. I wish I could play all of them, but we have to play just 11 players. Uh, we're gonna go into a game and I'm gonna try my team out. Let's go. First opponent, Al Hilal. Uh, they have uh, Jovinko, one of our axes, but uh, uh, anyway, we start. Uh, Jervinho there misses a great opportunity. Big boy Cornelius misses that. He's so big in the air and I can show you uh, all day highlights like that but I'm gonna move directly to the goals now and uh, I suffer a strange goal that but anyway I'm gonna recover Cornelius there beautiful pass Hernani to Gervinho to Hernani again to Kuska beautiful build up Kulusevsky and he's gonna bang that now my, my opponent makes a mistake and uh, Gervinho it's not gonna forgive him and he's gonna punish it a uh, 2-1 for me uh, first half is not finished uh, there's something left there to Gervinho to Cornelius Cornelius making the pass to Karamoa who's gonna make the pass again everybody's gonna get involved and Kulusevsky just uh, gonna finish that. Mr. Diversa, I hope that you follow the same instructions too because Kulusevsky for me needs to be in that camp position. Bobby, uh, Bobby in laser just uh, strikes it down the top corner. A uh, great shot and 4-1 uh, for us. Uh, he's gonna get one back and it's going to be 4-2. Uh, Kulusevsky to Gervinho, he's gonna finesse that and 5-2 for me. And this game is gonna be uh, over. And uh, I'm gonna move now uh, to a next game. Uh, we're gonna face Celtic here. Uh, there is just one highlight here, and it's going to be with a big boy Cornelius banging that. I mean, uh, after that he decides just to to not play, and uh, wasn't worth showing you. I uh, take the win on a disconnection. Here, uh, I mean, look at what Hernani does. Incredible, fantastic strike. Great, great, great goal. Uh, one of the best goals I scored in FIFA. And uh, another highlight here uh, to Gervinho, and uh, Gervinho is going to miss that. Uh, going up, trying again to score a goal. Uh, Cornelius here to Kuska to Varela. And Cornelius is gonna try, but uh, again across, but I won't be able to score. So uh, this game is concluded and 1 0. I hope that uh, you enjoyed. See you in another FIFA 20 video and all love to Parma fans out there. Bye!